God bless you, brothers and sisters. My name is Jessica Cruz, and I am the mother of Jezebel, Giselle, and Edwin Cruz. We've been sharing, I've been sharing a lot of dreams and visions of my family that we've had in relating to the asteroid, in relating to the rapture, and um, just dreams that we've had, Lord, of the Lord. I'm sorry. I feel very blessed, brother, that how the Lord is being used in my kids and my husband and myself. I remember when I first had the dream of, of that gigantic, enormous wave coming towards Key West, Florida. I didn't understand that at that time, brothers. But then it wasn't until a few years later when I was recovering from a surgery, I was looking into videos on YouTube and I came across the video of Brother Efrain Rodriguez in relating to the asteroid and that wave heading towards the East Coast. And to be honest, I didn't believe in his in his um, what he was saying. But then I paused the, the computer and I started praying. And then the Lord bring me to the to my memory that dream that I had about uh, the wave in Key West, and I felt the great confirmation of the Holy Spirit that it was truth, brothers. I told my husband later on and at that time and he didn't believe me and it wasn't until a few, I think it was a year later, he was in another country and he had another dream about a wave heading to Puerto Rico, a huge tsunami wave. He remembered about my dream and he said, I remember when you told me and I didn't believe you and look at me now, I'm having this other dream. This is unbelievable. And from then and on, brothers and sisters, he's been having more dreams and saw us, my kids, and we've been sharing them here with you guys. Because I know that the Lord, he doesn't want us to keep those dreams for us. He wants us to share them with others so that it can help, so that it can be like a confirmation to us all, so that we can be ready, so that we can be ready and focus only on him, so that we can all have a closer relationship with him. And I'm taking this opportunity now uh, to, to share with you guys about a dream that I had. I think it was two weeks ago. I dreamt that I was uh, watching TV with my husband. We were watching the uh, NASA channel and they were showing that an asteroid was coming to the Earth and that the U.S. was getting ready to, to shoot the asteroid with a missile or something like that. I cannot really remember the details. But I do remember saying that we were in danger, not only because that asteroid was heading to us, but because when they shoot that asteroid, that asteroid was going to be blown into pieces. So those pieces were going to be um, falling here, here on Earth. Then the image went in black of the TV, and then I was terrified. I saw myself like in the third person, like I was watching me having that dream. Then I woke up. Um, I also take the opportunity to tell you guys, to give you guys a little bit of a background of myself. Brothers, when I was pregnant of my son, Edwin Cruz, um, I was a Mormon. I was a member of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day -day Saints. And I remember when the doctors told me that Edwin was going to have his spinal cord, I'm sorry. His spinal cord wasn't really growing. And I went under more tests, blood tests and uh, sonograms. And they also told me that um, Edwin was gonna have a rare Down syndrome, that he was gonna be like in a vegetable stage. He won't be able to move or talk. And he suggested me and my husband that we can terminate the pregnancy, that we can have an abortion. We were young and that we could we could um, always keep on trying to have a healthy boy. Those were the words of the doctors. I remember I almost fainted and I'm just glad that didn't even cross my mind of, to have an abortion. My son is healthy now. He's, he's never had any problems. He, he used to, um, he would run uh, 5Ks now with no problems, brothers. And he's having a lot of dreams and visions of the Lord. And I feel so blessed that even though I was a Mormon, which I am not saying that that is a bad religion at all. All I'm saying is that I used to 
as an ex-Mormon, I used to read more the Book of Mormon than the Bible. But now I feel blessed that I'm only focusing on Jesus Christ. I am, I'm only focusing on having a closer, closer relationship with him only because he is the only one that is going to take me back to my Abba, to my Father in heaven. And right now I'm showing you this scripture that I love. I have it in Spanish and I have it in English here. Okay, brothers, God bless you. And let's keep on sharing more dreams and visions that we've had. The Lord doesn't want us to stay those dreams, um, to stay quiet, but he wants us to share them with others. God bless you. And let's continue to pray without ceasing, brothers. God bless you all.